Hello friends, welcome back to DevOps Hint. In this video, we are going to talk about my exporter. And in this video, we are going to uh, learn how to get Windows machine matrix using WMI exporter. So in this video, we are going to cover these three points. What is WMI exporter? How does WMI exporter works? And how to install WMI exporter? So start with first, what is WMI exporter? So the firstly, uh, it is same like node exporter, but node exporter for Linux machine and for Windows machine, we provide WMI exporter and WMI, exp WMI means Windows Management Instrumentation. And WM exporter is an exporter utilized for Windows servers to collect metrics like CPU uses, memory, and disk uses. And it is open source, which can be installed on Windows server using the .msi installer. So that's the WM exporter. So the next is WM exporter works. So you can see on the diagram. So as a reminder. Uh, so as you remember, Prometheus is a constantly scrapping targets and targets are node that are expo exposing metrics on a given URL and accessible by Prometheus. Such targets are equipped with exporters and exporters as binary running on a target and responsible for getting and aggregating metrics about the host itself. And if you were to monitor a Linux system, you would run a node exporter, which would be responsible for gathering metrics about the CPU uses or the disk IO currently in use. So for Windows host, you're going to use the WMI exporter and the WMI exporter will run as a Windows service and it will be responsible for gathering metrics about your system. So in short, here's the final architecture that you are going to build. So now, we are going to install WMI exporter. So to use WMI exporter, you need a Windows machine. So the first thing is we need to create one window instance. So you can see here, I have already created Windows with the name Windows. Now, uh, the next thing is we need to uh, connect our instance. Uh, so connect with RDC. So here you can see. So now, we are going to uh, install WMI exporter. So the WMI exporter is not available in Prometheus official documentation. So we have to download it externally. So search here WMI exporter and now we are going to here. And then if you click on uh, uh, see here installation and click on release page. So here you can see the latest release. So you can see the .msi. 0.16.0. So download it. And now you can see here, I have already downloaded. And now we are going to install. So click on write and click on install. So if you're installing for the first time, Windows Defender might restrict you to run it. So click on more and then run. So now it's done. So now let's check. So firstly, so let's check it's uh, successfully installed or not. So go to the start and here search service, services. And here, if you scroll down, you can see Windows Exporter. Window, uh, here you can see Windows Exporter and the status is running. That means it's successfully installed. So uh, running now, and now we are going to check with browser browser and firstly copy your ip address and in browser paste the ip address and the port number is 9182 so you can see a windows exporter so click on matrix so you can see our wmi exporter started exposing our windows matrix on port number 9182 so if you scroll down, we can see the matrix with the starting with Windows service. So it's done. So next is now we are going to add this into Prometheus target. So you can see in Prometheus target, there is 
to first uh, node exporter and then Prometheus. Now we are going to add here one more with the name Windows, Miss WMI exporter. So firstly, we need to update our WM, uh, so dot YML file that file. So let's start. So firstly, we need to run this command to uh, update our w, uh, configuration file. So here you can see there is two job here. Firstly, you can see the first name is Prometheus here. And the second job is here, node exporter. Now we are going to add one more job with the name WM exporter. So now add one more job here. And here the job name is WMI exporter. And our IP address, copy our Windows IP address. And our port number is 9182. Okay. So, yes, the indentation is correct. Okay, now save the file and exit. And now you need to restart our Prometheus server. Okay, it's done. So let's check. So go to the Prometheus. And now here click on status and go to the target. Wait for some time. Go to the target. So WM exporter. Mm. Yes, here. Now our indentation is proper. That's why they give a error because our indentation is not properly. So now it's properly. Yeah, now save the file and exit. And now we are going to restart our Prometheus service. And now let's check. So wait for some time. Go to the target and here you can see WM export and the state is up. So if you go to the Prometheus and here uh, execute the query up. So here you can see the three results first node exporter, then WM exporter, then Prometheus. That means it's successfully. Uh, it's successfully adding target, so you can see a WM exporter. So it's done. So in this video, we have learned what is WM exporter and how to install WM exporter and how to add uh, in a target Prometheus target. How to add WM exporter into Prometheus target. So thank you for watching our video. I hope you like the video and it's helpful share and subscribe our DevOps and channel.